I've always been amazed that in the centre of Cambridge, this great hub and home for science, there's nothing that talks about anything that's happened in the last hundred years of the great discoveries, research, inventions in the centre of this town. The Science Centre is a huge and important development, a base where everyone can actually learn, can enjoy their time, can enjoy science because it tells us so much about ourselves. So science centres like this are absolutely vital. And do you know what? Somewhere among you is the next great big idea. What I really want to achieve with the Science Centre is a fascination with how the world works. What we're looking to do is communicate why science is exciting, why the world around us is exciting, and how science helps us to key into that. If kids are fascinated in something, they will keep on giggling at it until they can understand it. When we've had school groups in here and families in here as part of our little previews, they've had an amazing time. They've been playing, discovering things that we haven't thought about about some of our hands-on exhibits, and that's really a powerful thing. They've been looking at some of the models of the ear and looking at these three little bones and how they fit in. And I think they've been really enjoying it today. It's really nice to see. Seeing kids playing with something I've spent hours and hours building and appreciating it and getting it is the biggest buzz I've had for ages. They're really getting quite a lot from it. I'm surprised. The young kids, but they're really enjoying the, uh, the displays. I really like doing the fan and I also like the voice box. I think these exhibits are built by geniuses. I think my favourite part is the generator exhibit. It's a really, really classic science centre exhibit. It's a really, really physical way of both feeling what power means. You can start to understand why it's bad idea to leave all the lights on because something somewhere is going to get hard to turn and that's going to cause you know, more effort and that's going to be more energy. Talking to parents and their children about science is, is fabulous because you're helping them start a conversation which hopefully they'll go home and carry on. I think it's wonderful to finally have um, a kind of modern science centre in Cambridge, kind of new space that can explore different facets of science. I think it's going to bring science more to the public and give them an opportunity to find out about basic science but also about some of the really high level stuff that's happening in the university, some of which actually will impact people's real lives on a fairly short time scale. And it also allows the opportunity for the public to ask us questions and sometimes those questions can be quite inspiring and we can get ideas from things that we would never have thought of. Today we're focusing on sensory biology and there's some engineering here as well but it would be nice to see uh, other aspects of Cambridge science being represented as well and I'm sure in the future as the displays begin to rotate we'll start to see more of them. What's excited me most about opening this space is seeing people's reaction when they walk in and realising that Cambridge now does have an interactive science centre. The location is fantastic. As you can see, uh, it's a beautiful aesthetic space and we're really looking forward to uh, engaging the public and schools over the next few years. It's a lovely space for people to explore various uh, science principles and see what current research is going on in Cambridge. So with the Science Centre, we really hope it's an amazing experience for all our visitors, whether it's families coming along during half term or holidays or in the afternoon, school groups in the morning, or even adults coming along and checking out and having a bit of fun for themselves in the evening. This place is going to be a great hub for events and activities and we really hope they enjoy it a lot. It's been absolutely fantastic just seeing the centre being used properly for the first time. Everything's come together, we're here, the space is open and it's buzzing, it's fabulous.